Hi, I'm Anastasia. I'm a second year student at LaGuardia Community College and the president of PTK Honor Society. I'm here today to give you some suggestions on how to succeed as a student at LaGuardia right now. Um, first thing, you're working from home, it's totally different. You have to create a space that makes sense for you. Some people are alone, some people have big families. Everybody's in a different scenario. Um, what's most important is to consider your major and your best working environment, and then try to find a small area, even if it's three feet by two feet, just a tiny area of your house, whatever you can take, that is yours. It's got your books, everything's organized the way you want it to be. Once you go into that spot, you're working. There's no, I have my dinner in this area. It's totally go time. When I'm here, I'm mean business. So that's the first thing that's gonna help a lot. Now for many people, they have families, right? And lots of people around, they're like, that's hard to do, I have children, etc. Um, if you're in school, you're probably looking to start a career and one of the biggest things to learn, the best skills to have, is how to advocate for yourself. And so your education is important. Often you're paying for it, you're working very hard to pay for it, um, and you work very hard for it. So when you work, it's important to let your family know, like, listen, from, you know, 6.30 to 7.30, I need to study science or whatever it may be. Create a schedule for yourself. It'll help keep you accountable, but also it'll let your family know or whoever you're with, like this is important and I need this time. This is part of my mental health, my career um, objectives. And if it's organized, it should work a lot better. Another thing, not everybody has what they need. Um, luckily, the school is willing to provide a lot of that. You can get Wi-Fi codes if you don't have Wi-Fi, and I even have a Dell laptop that I was able to get from the school. So if you need any technology, please go to the library or contact your advisor to find out how you can make that happen. Make sure you check your school email. Everybody hates it because it's slower or whatever, it's Outlook, you're not used to it. Trust me, it makes life so much easier. There's an application, download the app, take the 20 minutes, crank, be cranky about it, yell about it, and then once it's done, your life is so much better. Um, your professors will be able to get in touch with you better. You'll see more opportunities. You'll see more um, scholarships, different programs. It's really important to be active with your your My LaGuardia, your, your email. Um, also, checking into your My LaGuardia. There, you have quick tabs to be able to reach out to librarians, tutoring centers, to your personal, uh, personal advisor. So those things are gonna be crucial in working from home. Um, if you need, if you're part of ASAP, they have a ton of things on Microsoft Teams. That's a huge, huge benefit. Make sure to reach out to that. Um, there are eBooks, you can get free books online. You just have to reach out to these people and they're there to help. Um, the PTK, PTK, which I'm part of, is running two different training sessions for the student orientation. So if you are excited about this, you want to learn more about it, maybe you're nervous about starting classes, find us. It'll be showing up in the next month on your My LaGuardia. And the two courses are called How to Succeed Virtually and Finding Your Squad. And we talk all about these things that students have questions about and how to make it work. Most important, be creative, have fun, and know that you can do it. I'm serious, be creative. <laughs>